Hey everyone, Creating Spaces here, back with another short production tutorial. Uh, today I want to talk about NewGen Aligner, a new plugin from NewGen which helps you to align audio tracks uh, perfectly. Uh, also to avoid phasing issues and stuff. Uh, so go out and grab it. Uh, you just have to fill in a, a short survey and that's it. Uh, but more on that later. Uh, normally you would use uh, the plugin on, um, for example, multi-mic setups, uh, multi-mic drum recordings. Uh, but today I'm going to show you how I use it. I use it to align the recordings of my beautiful Revox A77 tape machine behind me. Uh, I actually use the Revox as a send effect in Ableton. I got the idea from the amazing Felix Fleer, who did an analog warmed uh, session uh, for Thomas synthesizers called uh, Between the Lines. Be sure to look it up. Link in the description below. As always, if you like the video, subscribe to my channel and uh, give me a, a thumbs up. See you later. Bye. So what do you need to do to get the plugin? You go to the newgenaudio.com website uh, slash aligner and there you can uh, fill in a survey. Just click on it, uh, you get the survey, you fill the whole thing in, it's not much actually. And uh, when you're done, you get the serial for the free uh, aligner tool from NewGen. So we're in Ableton now, we have this drum loop here. I'm gonna send it now to um, the return channel here where I have my external device set up, which is the, of course, the tape machine. So uh, you'll hear that. What you hear actually is the, the tape delay from the tape, which is uh, pretty cool. Uh, so we're gonna record it in now and then record the audio back from the return channel into a separate uh, audio channel here so we can uh, record the recording from the tape. Tape machine is set on a monitor in. So um, this is the, the brilliant uh, thing about this setup that you don't have to uh, yeah, record a tape, play it back, load it in with the uh, external device here in Ableton. Uh, it saves you a lot of trouble. Okay, so let's do this. Okay, that should be enough. We have the, the recording here. So now let's put them in arrangement view and I'll first line them up manually to see uh, yeah, what you can achieve with that. Okay, let's hear how these two sound together. Yeah, as you can hear, uh, I think we immediately have some uh, phasing issues. Okay, uh, now let's put new gen a liner on both channels and see if it can work its magic. Okay. Uh, you can hear immediately that uh, it makes a huge difference, uh, yeah, which is very cool, so you don't have to uh, hassle anymore with uh, aligning it, trying to align it perfectly. Okay, so what do we do now? Now that we have it aligned, we just recorded it in a, in a new audio channel here. And uh, yeah, uh, we, we have the, the good file then. Okay, let's hear these two together. So yeah, as you can see, uh, perfectly aligned. The difference between the, the tape recording here and uh, what Nugent did with it is, uh, is amazing. So yeah, for me, this tool is a real lifesaver, so uh, I would say go out and get it and uh, have fun creating music.
till next time bye